She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. If you are new, my name is Natalie. I go to the University of North Texas and I am a senior and I'm also majoring in accounting. So if you are new here, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button and just stick around and see more of my upcoming content. If I do sound a little bit different than normal, that's because like I woke up with a really stuffy nose and um, my throat is hurting today so I am already on my second cup of tea for the day and it's only 11 50 in the morning um, I was fine yesterday but I have noticed that my nose has been really dry for like the past week to two weeks um, due to the cold weather and this might sound like gross but I've been having like some blood kind of in my nose um, so I knew my body was like either just going through allergies or like trying to fight something and then sure enough this morning I woke up with my lymph nodes swollen and my throat hurts when I swallow. I have no fever and um, my boogers are now like a green yellow. Not sure if that's TMI or not but um, yeah i just don't feel the best today but anyways it's tuesday it's february 23rd and um this morning i woke up around 5 30 in the morning um to use the bathroom and that's when i woke up with like my throat and stuff and i made a cup of tea chugged that down and went back to sleep and then woke up around 8 15 and started reading chapter seven for my audit class and I actually finished reading that for audit and now I'm about to start the chapter seven learn smart assignment for audit um it's just like answering questions from the book and there's only 25 concepts to answer but it is time consuming and I'm not sure why but it is time consuming um i have my purifier going right now i have some rc oil in it which is really good for like when you're sick and have like respiratory issues and stuff like that and then i made a second cup of tea this morning i had the actually i think this is my third cup this is my third cup of tea already so 5 30 this morning i made the throat coat tea and then in the vlog this morning i think i picked up my camera around i don't know like 9 30 9 45 something like that that's when i went downstairs and ate breakfast and stuff that was my second cup of tea and then now this is my third i'm drinking a lemon ginger tea and all of these are caffeine free 
I just put a little bit of honey in there because honey is really good for like sore throat. And then for breakfast, I put two toast or I put two loaves of bread in the toaster oven, toasted them, and just put butter and honey on them. That's kind of my go-to breakfast whenever I'm sick. I haven't had that in a very long time because I haven't really been sick in a long time. So um, normally when I'm sick, you know, or like don't feel well, I get loss of appetite and stuff. So that's something that I normally eat when I'm not feeling well. So I ate that this morning, took all my vitamins, and now I'm going to start some homework. I do have class today, and I also have my cost accounting exam tonight. Not looking forward to that. And then I work tomorrow, Friday, and Saturday. So I'm hoping that whatever I have is like goes away fast. Um, but I have my data mining class at 2 o'clock from 2 to 4.50. And then I have my cost accounting exam tonight from 6.30 to 8.30. Oh, this is like hot and it feels so good on my throat. Oh my goodness. Um, so I might make a cup of coffee later, like before class. I don't really want coffee right now. Um, today's just gonna be like a chill college day in my life, online class style, because you know, hashtag Zoom University. Um, but anyways, just figured I'd kind of jump on here update you guys say hello don't forget to like the video and i'm going to start working on my chapter 7 book smart assignment for audit class what if i wake up happy and what if i wake up sad sorry if i said something something that made you mad that I could call you Sorry my service bad My bad When I wake up you're not next to me Guess I'm missing all your energy That's all I want That's all I want Promise I am not your enemy I just need another memory That's all I want Cause all I want is you Okay, so I have been working on this vouch and trace case for my audit class and this Excel spreadsheet was provided by my professor. And as you can see here, we have a bunch of different sales in the sales journal, invoice numbers, the amounts, and the balance on the accounts. And basically what I have to do is go in and check and make sure that the amounts are correct. Um, if there was any shipping documents, if the totals are correct, and just like kind of verify everything. And then um, I kind of have to follow these little instructions slash hints that he has provided for us. And this is due on Friday and I literally just started. Um, it's going to take some time. So I just did the occurrence section right here. I went and looked at the sales journals, looked at the shipping documents um, to see if it like actually shipped out and um, there was one where the prices were greater on the invoice than the sales order so I had to do like little tick marks let me show you what mine looks like so this is the example he provided for us and then mine looks kind of similar but within my own work so this is my work and then I have little like tick marks right here at the bottom and right now it's 115 and let me tell you I'm feeling low-key like not well right now I'm hungry I'm gonna go eat something and I have class at 2 but I'm literally like about to fall asleep 
Um, Chris just favored some coffee. So that should be coming to my house, which was really sweet of him. Um, I could have just like made my coffee at home, but it's fine. I feel like I look kind of pale, so I'm going to go get something to eat. And then I have class at 2, so I'm going to do a review for my data mining class because we have a quiz today. This is quiz number 3, I believe. No, 4. I think it's quiz 4. And she always posts like review slides and a review lecture for us. Um, so I'm just going to kind of review those slides. Normally they're about like three to four slides. So I'm just going to review them quickly before class and grab a bite to eat. And that's my brother. He's just so loud playing video games. But anyways, yeah, I think my coffee should be here soon. But I'm hungry now, so I'm going to go get something to eat. Predictors, you can also call it dependent variable versus independent variables or response variable versus explanatory variables. So we have Y and X, car price and car features, and then we assume Chris had a coffee sent to me. Um, he just like door dashed it and it says, hope you have a lovely day, Chris. It's so cute. He just got me a triple iced vanilla latte with oat milk and that was very sweet of him. Thanks, babe. a little update i sound horrible right now um and my throat hurts really bad it's five o'clock we got out of class around i don't know like 5 30 so like i don't know 20 minutes early um she went over some powerpoint slides we did some coding with the r studio software and she went over the exam review because i have my data mining exam next tuesday march 2nd i think yeah and then i have i think a tax exam next thursday march 4th i think and then tonight i still have my cost accounting exam at 6 30. um i was supposed to work tomorrow but i texted my manager and i told her like the situation that i woke up this morning with a sore throat um, and I had drainage this morning, so I thought like my th my sore throat was just from drainage and like allergies. But literally like as the day went on, my throat just like got worse and worse today. So I told her and then I just, I checked my temperature this morning and I didn't have a fever. I just checked my temperature now. It's 506 right now and I have 100.9 fever. So I also put a flashlight in the back of my throat and looked in the mirror and it's very red and I think I saw some like white spots so I don't know if I have strep or not I don't know how the heck I got strep because I was 
literally like with my fiance yesterday and he woke up fine this morning no sore throat no nothing so i don't know where i got it from if i even do have strep but i made a um appointment on the doctor on demand app to do a video call with the doctor at 5 30 and um hopefully they'll give me some antibiotics um so i don't work tomorrow but i'm hoping by friday and saturday i'll feel better like a little bit better since and i'm hoping i'll have antibiotics tonight or tomorrow and then um yeah i still have to take my exam so i have a video call at 5 30 with a doctor and then i have a, an exam at 6 30 so uh that's what's going on today um see sometimes like days just don't really work out as a college student sometimes you think you're gonna have a productive day and then really like you end up getting sick um i mean like i did get stuff done today it's just it wasn't I feel like it was more of a chill, productive day, if that makes sense. Like, I did everything in my bed, did my homework in my bed, was in class on my bed. Um, for my exam, I'll probably have to be at my desk, though, because there's a camera and a lockdown browser and everything. But I feel like today, like, I did get stuff done. It just was more chill and, like, laid back, if that makes sense. So I'm going to stop talking for now and drink some Gatorade. I didn't even finish my coffee because I think it made my throat worse. So I'm going to put the rest in the fridge and try and drink like some Gatorade water and um, just like get some rest. Um, so I'll update you guys after the video call with the doctor and probably if I have time before my exam, I'll update you guys. If not, then I'll update you after my exam. Okay, bye guys. Currently eating some pita bread right now. Um, you guys, I literally feel like crap. I feel so miserable. I just finished taking my exam and let me catch my breath because my throat hurts really bad. Like I can barely talk. Okay, so I told you guys earlier that I was doing a video call with a doctor at 5.30 so I did that she gave me an antibiotic a steroid and a cough medication so i started that antibiotic tonight went ahead and got my prescription so i just took my antibiotic um after the video call i had about like 30 minutes before my exam so i went downstairs and made some cream chicken ramen soup and then ate some crackers with it and then ran upstairs and then from 6.30 to 8.30, I took my cost, my first cost accounting exam. Literally, those two hours were miserable. I was, like, starting to, like, doze off. I, I started to get body aches. I still have body aches now. My throat was starting to hurt. I was getting hot. And I was just, like, I literally, like, I don't even care what I got, what I get on this exam. I just want to lay down. But... I got my grade, I got an 83 on the exam, round of applause, I have strep throat, which sucks, um, so then the doctor said that I had 75% of the criteria for strep throat, um, about like a week and a half ago, I did wake up with like my lymph nodes swollen and a dry nose, and then it went away, so she said that it started as a virus and then turned into a bacteria infection, so... She went ahead and diagnosed me with strep throat. I've had it before. I've had it a couple times. It literally sucks. Like, I am so scared to swallow because it, when I swallow, it hurts so bad. Like, just drinking water hurts so bad. So, um, during my exam, I started to get really nauseous. So I went downstairs and in order to take my antibiotic and everything I have to take it with food so I just warmed up some leftovers from the other night 
um, some fajitas and then ate like literally like a tiny bit and then took my antibiotic. I took Tylenol for the aches and pains. And you guys, literally, I'm about to hit the hay. I'm so tired and I feel like legit crap. Like, legit crap. On a scale of 1 to 10, I'd probably say a 10 right now. Um. Oh my gosh, it hurts so bad to swallow. Um, it's 8.50, so... There it goes, it's not even loading. Okay, whatever, you guys get the gist. Um, but I'm just gonna end this vlog here. I'm kind of nervous about editing this vlog because I don't know how exciting it's gonna be, but it's real content, it's a real day, and you know what, I'm gonna put this on my channel because it's real content. This is literally a college day in my life. Got homework done, had a class, took an exam, and I feel like crap. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope I am better by the next time I pick up my vlog camera. And, um, I'm gonna go to sleep. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.